morning guys welcome to today's vlog so I am sweating horribly right now and trying to make it to the hair salon because I have an appointment had a bad morning I'm starving so I'm eating bread That's all I can grab I grab bread and a bag of chips I like bread I eat bread a lot plain but still what I can grab walking out the door. Had a horrible morning. I don't even have a good place to put my camera in the car, so it's probably moving around, whatever. Need to get something. I tried once and it didn't work. Um, but anyways, had a horrible morning. I got an annoying, discouraging email. Um, I then realized that I don't have my wallet. I don't know where it could possibly be. Um, my dad likes to move things around and hide my stuff. Not from me, but just hide it, like, to keep it safe. Like, he doesn't like anything laying out anywhere. So he's really weird about that stuff, and he likes to put everything away. So I think I left it laying on the kitchen table, and I think he might have put it away. <laughs> I don't know that, but I think he might have because he's done that before. But I don't know where he would have put it. So he's not here. He's, well, he's not home. So I tried to call him. <laughs> and I love my dad. I really do. I'm not complaining about my dad. But he is so bad at answering his phone. But then I thought, well, he's, he's with my brother right now. So I was like, okay, that's fine. I can just call Justin. And Justin doesn't answer. <laughs> I call him like five times. He doesn't answer the phone. So I'm like, well, I could call Justin's wife and see if he, she could tell him. She's supposed to be with him too. And she doesn't answer either. And of course, like, obviously people don't have to just sit around and, you know, wait for me to call him. But, um, it's, of course, when you're waiting for, you know, somebody to answer, you'd think one out of three people would answer. But it's just one of those times where nobody answered. So, I never found the wallet. And, um, I'm gonna have to deal with that later, thankfully. I, like, was able to still come. I Basically, I don't have my ID. Hello? Yeah, are you with Dad? Yeah. Can I talk to him, please? Yeah. Hey, have you seen a, a big gold wallet? A big what? A gold wallet. It's big. It's not like a little wallet. Like for you or something? Yeah, it's mine. Oh. Alright, so my dad said he didn't know where the wallet is. But anyway, I'm getting my hair done. I'm, uh... Um, I haven't gotten it done in a long time. I've been dyeing it myself. Um, red, Manny and I have been dyeing it. I've gotten it done professionally red, too. Um, but I've been doing it myself because I actually really like the color, uh, from, from L'Oreal, Feria from L'Oreal. I really like that one from Vox, which I know, like, Vox dye, and people have their opinions about it, but whatever. I, I really like the color. Um, but I wanted to get it professionally done because I want to gradually go back to blonde, it's easier to maintain for me. My natural hair color is like a dirty blonde, light brown. Um, so it's easier to maintain because I like roots with blonde, but I don't like roots with red. So I have to like really maintain the red. I'm sure I'll go back to red eventually because I truly like love that. Um, but I want to gradually go back to blonde and I'm also getting a cut because I can't deal with this anymore. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I've always gone back and forth between red and blonde and I used to do like all kinds of colors. But once I go like really blonde, I wanna maybe add some fun colors back into it. Um, it's probably dark in here. It's a big tree area. So I'm going back to a place that I really, really, really like. Um, it's, I'm actually going to a new girl though that they have there. I don't know how new she is. I think she is newer actually at the salon, but um, I normally had gone to the owner of the salon. Uh, she was the one that did my hair, but she was booked solid until September. And with not knowing where I, I don't even know literally where I'm gonna be in September, if I'm even gonna be in this area. So um, I didn't wanna wait that long. And plus my hair, I, I don't wanna dye it red again because of wanting to go back to blonde, that makes it harder if it's freshly red. So um, I wanted to leave it, but it doesn't look good like it is right now, faded and everything, so, and the roots. So I'm gonna hurry up and get it done. So I booked an appointment with this girl that um, I've seen her work and she looks like she does a really good job. The owner I know personally, like I said, she used to do my hair. And um, I've never like seen her like hire somebody not good. <laughs> like they're all good. So 
I'm, I'm not worried about it. I'm excited to get my hair done, but honestly, I hate sitting there for so long. My hair is so thick. So that's why I make sure that I eat something. I bring the water in with me. It's gonna take a while, and I know that. So I'm just preparing myself for that. All right, I made it to the salon. I'm gonna go ahead and get my purse ready. I do have that. And uh, everything, and go inside. So next time you see me, the next time you see me, I might have like foils on my head or something, but next time you see me in the car, I'll have my hair done. Do you have homework, Kate? So I am honestly like probably too grouchy to vlog right now. Uh, it's nobody's fault, but I'm really hungry. Um, like really hungry and my sugar has dropped and I could honestly cry because I don't feel good <laughs> at all. It took, it is literally, you guys, I went in there at 11.45. She started right on time, and it is 5.15, and I'm just now going home. I am exhausted. I am so hungry. My head is absolutely throbbing. Anyways, it's not exactly what I want it to be because obviously it's going to take more than one time, but I'm not going to go back for a while because that was just wildly long. Like, I'm, I'm not really a per, I don't really like to get my hair done. I like the outcome of sitting there is rough because my back starts hurting and I get really like my sugar has dropped and it's been down for a while. I tried to eat these crackers in my bag that were stale and tasted like gum and they were actually making me sick and then I tried I had some gum and that helped but um they had like pop there that I should have gotten up and got gotten one of those. Uh, they were they're free but but anyway she said probably two more times and I'll be as blonde as what I want to be. But honestly, coming from red, I mean, it could be so much worse. It's not like red orange or anything. It's just like a, I don't know, it's a pretty color. That's nothing wrong with the color. It's just not exactly what I want because, and again, it's not our fault. I knew it wasn't going to be because, um, you know, it's uh, only after one time. Going from red to blonde is more of a process. So, um, yeah, I've started the process again. Like I said, I love red. Red is my favorite still. But even like when I have like, I really like platinum blonde. I've done that before. But red is still my favorite over all of those. But um, blonde is just easier maintenance for me. I have naturally lighter hair, not super blonde, but naturally like light, lighter brown. Um, some people say dirty blonde. Okay, so I'm home. This is what it looks like outside. Um, this side's like more red. Um, it needs to be, I haven't styled it yet, so it's not gonna look like this. But honestly, I wanted the cut different. I wanted it shorter than this in the back and more angled and I wanted one side longer than the other but at that point it had been so long that honestly I didn't want to say anything. Um, I mean she did a good job but it's just not exactly what I was envisioning for it but I'm going to go back and get it blonder. Um, I'm going to go and get it blonder so when I do I'll get the cut fixed as well but it's going to be a while before I go blonder. But anyways not like amazing lighting out here it's not a bad color it's just i'm excited to be blonder the color's fine because i knew it wasn't going to be super blonde today but the cut i went a little bit different but that's all right my mom could do it honestly but i doubt that she will hey guys i'm gonna mess with my hair a little tomorrow but i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog for today um tomorrow morning we're actually gonna be going somewhere fun not just in the morning for most of the day but um we're going somewhere fun so you'll see in tomorrow's vlog um what that is it's gonna be pretty fun to come check it out um I'm going with my sister haven't uh spent a ton of time with my sister since we've been back i've only seen her once so i'm excited about that um one of my sisters so anyways thank you guys for watching remember you are incredible jesus loves you so much i love you guys and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye guys